Hey, what's going on YouTube? Got another ROM review for you. This is the Hyperdrive, release number five by S. Breen over at xdadevelopers.com. Hyperdrive's been around for a while. I ran it on my Galaxy S3, and he is known for tons of options. There is no Aroma installer this time, but I'm sure they'll get that worked out, but he's still made available so you can download things over the air you can change you know some status bar stuff like that um, the change log is huge I'm not gonna read all of it because I'm trying to keep this video short some of the key features is um, he added the 4.3 camera with new features he removed the v6 supercharger binaries I uh, got the white keyboard from the i9505 Galaxy S4 uh, added full native call recording, which a lot of people like that. He developed his own Zeus Galaxy S4 kernel. Uh, let's see what else I'm looking at the deal here. Updated Google Now. I mean, just all. T oh, he had a transparent status bar for all wallpapers on the launcher, which is really cool. Because before, if you change the wallpaper, the bar wouldn't be transparent anymore. So he, got, he fixed that, that is cool. So anyway, let's get into it. This is just like a first look. This is not a full review, but just I want you guys to see what it looks like so you can decide if you want to download it yourself. You can see it's nice and smooth. Get the apps here. Uh, let's just open up some stuff here so you can see how fast it is. There's maps, see GPS does work. Yeah, point, let me, oops, oh well, sorry. There we go. It's working. Play Store. Oops, sorry about that. It's only swipe like the stock. I don't have a SIM card, but there's messaging. I'm just open up stuff so you guys can kind of see how fast it is. You have to invert YouTube, which is cool. dark instead of you know white which is that's cool uh, let's see watch on anyway I think you get the point guys it's, it's nice and snappy it's it's fast it works it's cool so I highly recommend you download this here's the new camera let me hold this up here so you can kind of see you see you got the before I had the circle now they have it so you can do that you know that's that's pretty cool it's a new camera get back out of that um, you see the wallpaper there which is really cool let me show you the lock screen yeah that's cool I like that wallpaper you can see that still works um, I was watching a video you don't have to drag down like that you don't you can do that if you want to or just grab the clock and move it to get to the other widget yeah, it automatically does it for you. Just a little tip there for you. I'll get back in here, go through some of the options. Yeah, the Wi-Fi toggle, which I don't know why they did that. That was so stupid. Um, there's, like I said, there's, it's looks stock here. You know, same old, same old. He did add the, his hyperdrive control center or whatever you want to call it that's where you get your over-the-air stuff that if you want you can download you know some things that are missing if you want now you can see it there I'm not gonna go through all of those what I do want to show you is this part here's UI oh let me show you this oh, what is UI uh, yeah I don't care for the LED control but some people like that but I do care about the Pi controls and custom fonts. As we know, if you have an S4, that when you try to download fonts, it won't let you. I have a video that you can watch. But if you run this ROM, you can just install it from here, which is really, really cool. Icon changer, which is nice. Let's see. Clock options. You know, you can, I like the center clock. You can change the AM, PM. 
You can add a day of the week if you want. Let's see what it looks like. Uh, okay. Sure, I'll leave it. Clock color. White. Let's go blue. Sure, why not? Stannis bar. I mean, it, there's just lots of options here, guys, that you can go through and change the look of your ROM. That is really cool. Um, let's see, there's something else I was going to show you. Is it here? Oh, yeah, I just went there. No. I almost got the CRT, which I think that's cool when you turn it off, how it does the, like the old TVs. <laughs> so you can turn it off and on if you want. If you don't like it, if you do like it, whatever. And yeah, let's see, what else? I'm looking at my notes here. Hang on. Oh, yeah, let's get into the. Let me show you what it is. So you can see there, you can see it. Release 5 of S Green, 4.2.2, yada, yada, yada. Um, oh, uh, Floating Notifications. You know, that's in that new app out, you know, Halo inspired it. And then there's an app called Floating Notifications. And yeah, I ran on my S3 with no problems on most ROMs. Well, um, I installed it on my S4, you know, when it was stock, and my phone flipped out on me. It did not like it at all. And then I made a mistake. I went into settings, into accessibility, and I tried to check to see that TalkBack was on. And it wasn't on, even though it was talking back to me. And I turned it on, which made it worse. And for I restarted the phone, tried to you know, get back in there. I finally got past the lock screen. I finally got it uninstalled. And so, yeah, it didn't work. Well, I installed it on this ROM. And it does work. I had, it's, as you can tell, it's not talking back to me. It, but it will talk back to you here. If you go in the gallery. If I take one of these and hold it down. The checkbox is currently checked. Yeah, thank you so much. So anyway. That is a minor bug. It is not the developer's fault. Um, it is Samsung, but it does work better on this ROM. So that's enough. I can live with that because I don't hardly ever do that. So that's cool. You got Pi Control. You have floating notifications. So anyway, all right, guys. Well, that's been just a little first look here. Um, I am looking for a daily driver. I'm going to flash some more ROMs here and make videos so you guys can see what they look like. And then I will pick one of them eventually, and I'll do a, like a full review or a check back review or whatever you want to call it. So anyway, guys, if you like this video, please hit that like button, help me out, and please subscribe for our future videos. Okay, guys, thank you. Have a blessed day.